cell phone radiation. Some say it's harmless, others say, well, let's just say the internet has no shortage of hysterical medical theories. One way or the other, the FCC says that all cell phones sold in the United States must be tested for their specific absorption rate, or SAR. It's the rate at which radiation from the phone is absorbed into your body, and the maximum allowed by the FCC is 1.6 watts per kilogram of flesh. I'm Donald Bell, and in this top five, I'll be counting down the cell phones that get the closest to that maximum legal radiation level. Starting off at number five, the Huawei Vitria with an SAR rating of 1.49. It's an entry-level Android phone available on Metro PCS for $130 prepaid. Seems like a screaming deal for an LTE-compatible Android phone. The only catch is it might be slowly sterilizing you from your pocket. Then again, maybe it's giving your junk some kind of superpower. Maybe that tingling sensation is just your spidey sense. At number four, the Alcatel One Touch Evolve. A 2.5 star rating from us, so don't say we didn't warn you. If you have this phone, there's only one reason you bought it. The price, $99 all in. Other than that, the screen is blurry, the Android is stale, the processor is slow, and there's no 4G support. On the plus side, the name implies that any mutation you might be getting is gonna be more of an evolution than a horrible deformity. At number three, with a SAR rating of 1.5, the Motorola Moto E, one of the best budget phones out there with a price of $140 and some well-rounded specs. Now, for just a little bit more, though, the Moto G is a much better phone, has the distinction of not being on this list. But the Moto E has some benefits. You get Android KitKat, a 4.3-inch screen, a gig of RAM, and a water-resistant coating that protects it from spills or rain or a sudden and unexpected loss of bladder control. Coming in at number two, the Motorola Droid Ultra with an SAR rating of 1.54. Now we know what that Ultra was for. It's an ultra dose of radiation for your gonads. And on a premium phone too, around $500 off contract. I was beginning to think this was all just a conspiracy to irradiate poor people. Turns out it's just a conspiracy to irradiate Android users. Finally, the number one phone that can double as a pocket warmer, the Motorola Droid Max. A 1.54 SAR rating and a 15 hour battery life that will keep that barely legal level of radiation blasting your lower body all day long. Now make no mistake, the Max is a 4.5 star rating from Cena and an editor's choice. It is an outstanding phone that raises the bar on performance, battery life, and potential tumor growth. Nah, just kidding. It's probably fine. Probably. So there you go, five phones that you may want to avoid if you're a hypochondriac. For more help finding phones that are right for you, as well as a list of phones with the lowest SAR rating, visit phones.cnet.com. I'm Donald Bell. Thanks for watching.